Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions Crystal Opening. So as you can see, we almost have enough for three basics, and we already have a featured five-star hero crystal uh, purchased that we're going to open up today. All right, but first, let's open up the uh, legendary and the ultimate crystals. And if we don't have enough, which I believe we will, uh, to have the five star, I have some four stars that I will open up. Uh, so we definitely will be opening up uh, three basics and one featured. All right. Actually, I didn't want to do that. Let's just open up the uh, legendary here. All right, so this one actually has a chance to pull a five star. And chances are we're going to get a four star, but, you know, uh, now I will have the dupe counter up when we open up the five star crystals. That's the only time I use the dupe counter. Out of these crystals, I don't do that because it's not guaranteed uh, to give me a five star. All right, so let's go ahead and tap that. Can we get a five star out of this? See some nice five stars waving by at me. Ooh, just one over, and that would have not been too bad. I already have him, of course. All right, but it would have been nice. But that, I have all of the four stars, so we get the uh, five star shards. Uh, no problem there. Uh, now, we also will get uh, five uh, star shards from this. You know, if nothing else. Uh, let me show you here. So the top one here will give us 400. All right. So uh, we got a couple of ways to get those uh, five stars. All right. Let's go ahead and open up these three star crystals here. I know they supposedly have a chance. I think I did get one. So not too terribly bad, but the majority like 99% of the time, it's a three star. So let's tap that, see what we got. Hey, five star, how you doing? But nothing, but three stars. Let's get another three star. You know, Kabam, if you want me to actually possibly look at those offers, maybe you should give me more than a three star out of these things. All right, let's tap that. We got, yep, I see some uh, five stars waving. Yeah, I wouldn't have been, actually, I probably would have still been a little salty because I keep getting him, but he would have been a max signature ability crystal. That's Stark Spidey. And another deal. Ignored. All right, so we're close. Now, what I'm going to do, uh, since we didn't get there quite, I'm just going to go ahead and open up. Like I said, I have all of them. Pop it. Here we go. All right. And let's see. All right, good. So we've got that. We'll grab, uh, claim that right there. Okay. So now we've got our three basics. And we've got that featured. So we're going to start with the basics so I don't accidentally open up, uh, like I did the last time, uh, a featured. Because the only features I ever get on purpose these days is from the sigil, if I have the sigil. All right, so let's go ahead and spin this out. I will pop up the dupe counter. And I will show you guys the champions that I want the most. All right, so we've got Namor, we've got Heimdall, we've got Domino, we've got Captain Marvel Movie, we've got Nick Fury, and we've got Omega Red. Would love any one of those champions. Uh, bottom left-hand corner, those are champions I have that I want to awaken. Sentinel, Darkhawk, and Void. I just recently got Void. All right, so let's find out. We got a new champion the last time. So... I think I might have to pay the piper, but I'm hoping for a new champion. 
But if I can get one of those, oh man, all right? Let's see. We got slowing down. Okay. Uh, one over would have been nice. That would have been a new champion. Stealth Spidey. I'm not a fan of his, though. Uh, but here we go. Uh, that's more six-star shards. You know, uh, with my roster, that's what you can expect. So we're going up with the dupe counter. Uh, now, I believe my dupe counter got up to like 11 before I pulled a new champion. So let's see if it takes that long again. Hopefully not. But if it does, again, that's more six star shards just gets us closer to the six star. All right. So let's let it spin out a little bit again. And I will take any new champion right now. But if I can get Namor or Domino or Omega Red, I can take these guys up to rank five. I can awaken them, uh, although I would not awaken uh, Domino. But Namor and Omega Red, I would use a generic on them. So if I can get one of them, great. Um, but I do have a decision to make. So how this goes will determine what I do a little bit later, all right? Slowing down, oh, ah, it could have stopped on any of those. Any of those would have been cool. You know, I would have loved either one of those, but it just kept going. All right, so Hood obviously is a dupe, so another on the dupe counter, but oh man, that would have been sweet. Any one of those uh, that it just skipped on by like that, would have been awesome. They would have been a new champion. All right, so last uh, one of the basics. And we'll see if we get anything other than a dupe. It will be great. It will be wonderful. Heck, I will take a crossbones. He would be new, and I do like crossbones. All right, so any new champion. We still have a featured uh, to open up after this one. But like I said, I do have a decision to make. Uh, what I'd like to do is I will set a limit on my waiting. You know, if I'm going to do something and I'm waiting to hopefully get a champion and I don't get it by a certain time that I set, I'll do one opening. And if I don't get them, I just move on, do something else. All right. Slowing down again. Wow. It hard stop there. It didn't hard stop before. Last time it skipped, skipped over. This time it hard stopped. Uh, I remember Ant-Man. I got Ant-Man and duped him in the same opening. It was when the Dungeon Crystals were first uh, in the contest. I actually opened up my first Dungeon Crystal, got an Ant-Man. My five-star crystal that I opened up with it, Ant-Man. All right, so here we go with the featured. All right, so featured crystal. Thankfully, it only cost a thousand more. Well worth it. Because you also get uh, five-star shards in the uh, Black ISO market. So it's definitely worth it. If I'm able to get the sigil again, uh, I was able to get this one from a kind benefactor. Um, but if I am able to get the sigil again, I will. Uh, but that's the only way that I open up featured uh, crystals. Because chances are I'm going to get a basic champion out of it anyway. And it's too expensive at 15,000 uh, shards. Way too expensive. All right. But all of these champions are not in the featured crystal. But let's see what we can get. Anybody good? Anybody good? Oh, boy. You could have stopped on that Black Widow. Oh, I would have loved that Black Widow. But see, this is why I don't get featured uh, champions, uh, crystals. Because if I had spent 15,000 on that, and got a Netflix Daredevil? Oh, I would not be smiling and happy. But now, you know, we got more dupes and we've got closer. Let's take a look here and see how close we are to our next six star. All right, so you can see we've got about halfway. All right, we're about halfway to our next six star. Uh, a little over halfway, in fact. All right, but that's gonna do it, guys. Not exciting. We didn't get any new champions. We got teased a little bit. Um, but this is what you can expect when you have a roster like I do. 
you're going to get a lot of dupes. And like I said, my dupe counter went up to, I believe, 11. And then I pulled Void, which I had wanted for the longest time. So it's time to pay the piper. All right. Now, uh, the next time I'm going to have a nice big opening will be the Doom Crystals. So maybe we can make up uh, and get a Doom out of those crystals. Don't know. Probably not. But that's going to do it, guys. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And you all have a blessed day.